you, Mr. Speaker. The law may be an ass, but it doesn't have to be applied in an asinine way, as in the case of Emma Appleby. So can he have words with the Home Secretary and make sure that is not repeated? My constituent, Bailey Williams, uh, is 16 years of age and suffers from the most severe form of epilepsy uh, with multiple seizures every day. And his parents, Rachel and Craig, are absolutely convinced that we need observational trials, that we need more immediate action. And sadly, and I accept it's unintended, the change in the law has actually made things worse for these parents, not better. What's the Secretary of State going to do to turn that around quickly? Yes. It, 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 it's a source of deep frustration to me that the change in the law to normalise the use of medicinal cannabis has, exactly as he said, um, made it meant that because a clinical decision is now needed for the prescription, and because those clinical um, decisions in many cases are not forthcoming, means that many parents who think that their child, and t entirely understandably think that their child um, would benefit from uh, medicinal cannabis, now find that they can't get a clinician to sign that off. And that is exactly at the root of the problems that we're trying to tackle today.